This is the 29th year for Coats for Kids, helping keep kids warm each winter. But Bob Gregory and company had a little help this year. Eyewitness News reporter Kevin Rader explains. The line which started forming at 2 a.m. says it all. With the cost of living, everything's so expensive now and really helps with the community. Good morning, how are you? For 29 years, Coats for Kids has helped to ensure that every central Indiana child who needed a coat gets one. This one is nice. For the last two years, two brothers have invoked an additional requirement. Mom, you like that? Yeah. All right. Nobody gets away without a coat and a half. All right. Now you need some gloves. Bill Murphy and his brother Dave decided a couple of years ago that just giving these kids a coat was not enough. They buy hats and scarves for, and gloves for every one of these kids that come through here and uh, get a coat. God's given us an opportunity to do something, and we should do it. Yeah! yeah. It's a lesson passed on by their parents. Now, the Murphy boys are passing it on to their children and grandchildren and to some of yours. It's worth it to you oh when you my see goodness. this, it, like that we, little girl right there. I mean, look at the smiles. I mean, the fact was God, God gave us this not to take with us, is, but to leave behind. They estimate between this endeavor and others, the family donates around $10,000 to the Salvation Army annually. Why not? We don't need anything. We've got everything we've ever needed. The family is the, the treasure you have around your table. And so we look at this as we, we take the kids. and This we, is almost your table. Oh, this is. This is the family around the table. This is the, the family. Right you here. look around here, and this is the family that we have. How would you like a red one? Come here. Come here. Let me put this on you. Let me look at you. The reward comes when the Murphys see the expression on the children's faces and at other times of the year as well. Last year, we were middle of winter, pulled up at a pulled up at a stoplight over here yeah, by the fairgrounds and we saw a couple of our hats that were pulled down and we saw two kids walking along with the hats that we'd given them away oh and we just sat there and thought oh this is the reason it's murphy's law gloves are highly you have a hat and it <laughs> kevin rader channel 13 eyewitness news and we can't put on coats for kids all by ourselves. This is a team effort, including the Salvation Army, Tuckman Cleaners, WTHR, and generous viewers like you.